This week's show is sponsored by PrintByMagic.com. We print directly to your bicycle playing yeah. cards. Um, <laughs> no time for champagne. Oh, sorry, we're starting. Sorry, we're sorry, starting. Yeah, it's the show. It's the show. Sorry. Yeah. We don't need that. We don't yeah. need that stuff. Okay. Hello and welcome to uh, the Magic World Review Show, week 29, I think it is. Really? I'm James Anthony. It is 29, wow. that's crazy. I'm James Anthony, this is... Sam Fitton. And uh, we are here, I've turned my phone off as well, so there's going to be no, no interruptions it's happening It's today. only taken three years. Ah, uh, anyway. It is good to have you back, dude. It's Thanks good to have much. you back. Yeah, it's good to be back. Today we are going to be reviewing two products. We're going to be reviewing the STEM system by Peter Turner and uh, World Magic Shop and... Blackout by Nefesh, if that's how you say it. I'm very sorry if it's not, but Nefesh. It is, it is. Um, so, before we start on this, um, first of all, we're going to give a very in-depth review of this, just because we feel, let's go to the STEM system, because of the pr price of it mm -hmm. and the duration of the course and the way it's pitched, we feel, felt that we needed to really... Yeah, yeah, I think we've got to get down and dirty really with Really down one. and dirty with oh, the best yeah, we can. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, and we've spent... Four hours watching it. Well, which the way is we pretty much how long it lasts. So at the end of the day, um, the way we figured it, if you're going to spend 150 pound on a product, you need to know as much as, as you, much possibly, as you can. possibly can. Yeah, yeah. I think that's only fair, isn't it? If you so, spend a lot of money on something. Yeah, and to be honest, I was ex dead excited about getting this. Oh, I was really, look at it. I was really excited, mainly because this is kind of if you've not heard of this, the STEM or the yep. STEM system. Yeah. Uh, however, that is, please get in touch, uh, Peter, if you can tell us what that's anyway, for. Before we get um, too down and dirty, let's cut to the trailer of this trick now. For anybody that's followed my story so far, you'll know that I've been privileged to work on television, radio and live shows around the world as a consultant, expert and off-screen advisor to some of the biggest names in our industry. And I'm excited to finally be able to bring to you the secrets and techniques used behind the scenes to make those performance performances look miraculous. Now I must say that this is not for novices or amateurs, because with this course, you'll leave your participants' minds blown. Mate, that's actually my number. Oh, you. No, yeah. no contact with the dealer, sir. I think you need to double check again what's wrong with you today. I am sorry, sir. Okay, so that is the trailer to the STEM system, yep. Peter Turner's. Mm -hmm. um, there's many, don't get me wrong, it looks great, doesn't it? We were excited about this product, yeah, though, weren't yeah. we, in terms of, like you mentioned, the packaging I think, is I, yeah, awesome. I mean, I mean, I think I think initially, um, what we've got to get across here, there's the STEM system, I'm not quite sure what that stands for, if you could let us know, Pete, that'd be great, or the S-T-E-M. Yeah, I was um, waiting for S is for this, it's, T it's is quite, for this. Yeah, 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 what? it's quite interesting, uh, yeah. it's called the STEM system, um, mm. but he calls it a course, Peter calls yep. it a course. David Penn, who's on the DVD with him, calls it a project most of the time, um, and I'm calling it a DVD. So. I would probably so, go with the latter as well. <laughs> yeah. so not, uh, besides that confusion, uh, this is yep. quite, I think, quite a different type of magic DVD, because yeah. it's yeah. also a new genre. Yep. It's not really trick method, trick method, it's yep. more a behind-the-scenes glimpse yep. um, of how you construct magic for TV, um, for uh, web series, uh, yeah. for YouTube. See, that's, um, I didn't know that until I got the DVD in my yeah, hands. Yeah. I thought, oh, this is going to give me inside information on mm. uh, you know, controlling producers, yeah. dealing with people, and mm. television magic. Yeah, that's why we want to give a bit yeah, yeah. of time to this review, because uh, it's not like we can say the trick got this kind of effect or response yeah, from yeah, somebody. Yeah. It's actually a little bit more in-depth than that. So yep. we thought, especially at the price, which we'll come to, uh, it really does justify it needs a, 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 good, a good look yeah. through. Okay. Um, so, what do you actually get so in this? You've, um, all the notes, yeah, you've shown oh, all the notes. Yeah, I mean, I mean it's just I've, non-stop notes. Yeah, I've got loads Ages. of notes on this yeah, DVD. Yeah. The reason why I've got loads of notes is because there's, there's, there's loads of content. There's four hours of video yeah. footage in this. Um, most of the time, that is uh, David Penn and uh, Peter Turner yeah. talking to each other. Um, Maybe a tenth of that is Peter either performing or showing you the pre-show. Yes. Uh, a lot right. of it is discussion-based, uh, and because of that, I would recommend stocking up on Pro Plus, Nest Cafe, 
go blend whatever your favourite yeah. caffeine that you had, you had three. I had, I had a good number of coffees, and it took me a real while to it's work quite my way intense. through this. It really is quite an intense. I was on the cross trainer last night doing yeah. it as well. Brilliant. <laughs> it's quite an intense watch. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and the reason why I say that is because there there is a lot of information. Yeah. Not all of that information is valuable. Uh, no. A lot of it is just discussion based. And as you mentioned, I think you really need to be listening and paying good attention to this DVD mm-hmm. to find those little, yeah. as they would say in America, golden think, nuggets and all this. But you need to be. Really... Yeah, I think what's important is if, I mean, if we look at the back, you can see that there, there, there's a little bit of, uh, I'll call it spiel slash blurb, yeah. uh, of what you're going to learn. You know, Peter Turner has been privileged to work on television, radio, live shows, blah, 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 blah. Peter finally reveals to you the secrets and techniques used behind the scenes to make those performers' performances yeah. look miraculous. So, what is actually in this DVD? Because that does not give you any clue no. whatsoever. And the trailer but, doesn't give you much to go on either. Isn't that pretty much the whole thing? It has these sort of like very vague sentences, very vague yeah, descriptions. I mean, so. I, mean, I, I mean, okay, so, so one of the first things. The first thing they cover is what is, why is this course important? Yeah. And I, I don't think they actually ever came to a definitive answer as to why it was important. Yeah. Um, I struggled anyway to find why it was important. Yeah. Um, how to get people involved? Yep. Uh, if you are filming, how to get engaged with people? Yeah, yeah. People randomly on the street. Um, there was stuff on, you know, how to make sure they're prepped, ready for the performance. Yep. Uh, and then how to make it look like you've you've not prepped them, uh, which is quite nice. Yep. There were a few um, good points in all of those. Know, um, some really nice ideas with um, kind of. Um, how to use the team that you've yep. got to your advantage. Yep. I can't really say much more than that. No, I'm actually giving you the content. Yeah. Um, but that was really nice. Yep. Um, and then he goes on to show you a few I got effects. a few really good points on that, to be fair. Yeah, yeah. I, that I might integrate into some, the next Some of the information in there is brilliant. Uh, there's, a, there's quite a few good key points. Yeah. I'd probably say there's a handful <clears> of, <throat> of really strong, good advice and tips. Yeah. But for, the, for the hardcore Professional, it's definitely aimed yeah, at professional, yeah. but as he said from the very beginning. But but it is kind of diluted in this discussion, and I think it, it would almost take a professional yeah. to watch it all and to yeah. try and uh, extract. God, if I was a beginner or intermediate, there's no way I'd even be able to understand yeah, yeah. a moment of this. So yeah. that's you, you, you really have to sit there and extract yeah. the best bits out of this DVD. Yeah. They're not giving it to you on a plate. No, nope. they're not saying do this. They're yeah. not saying this is how you do it. They're not leading. You know, not taking you by the hand and, and well, walking you through the park here. That you you have to go for a good rummage. You know, well, you made a very good point before about teaching and and expecting what you should get from a, a yeah. DVD in in that okay. term. So, so I I've got in trouble before now for taking quotes out of DVDs, magic DVDs, and um, you have. And, and not putting them in the correct context. So I will put this in the correct context this time. At the end of the first DVD, yeah. um, I think it's towards the end of the first, so it's certainly the first section that isn't the hypnosis. Um, they're talking about the, the intro to the hypnosis, yeah. and, and, and I wrote it down because it made me go, oh, um, that's interesting. Yeah. Um, and, and, and Peter says, if you don't get anything out of this, then you don't understand. Yes. And I think that's a little bit bold. Uh, that's slightly arrogant, perhaps. Um, and the reason why I say that is because I feel if I'm paying £150 for something, I should be being shown that information in a manner and in a way that I am able to understand it. Yeah. Not necessarily um, not yes. appreciate it. Yes, yeah, uh, yeah. You, know, you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah, you know, yeah, good, totally you know, good yeah. learning comes from good teaching yep. as well as being a good student. So. I think, I, I think, I think, to be able I think to you can't put the onus on out. the audience and say no. it's your fault if you don't get this. Which kind of is that how is that, that that's is kind how of it how came it came across, over. Yeah. Um, so anyway, that that's just one of the little niggles. Yeah. But <clears throat> besides that, there are a few inconsistencies in the DVD which okay. I picked up on which frustrated me. Now I'm right. not sure if many people will pick up on these things because I, I'm quite I, I, I'm happy to You're say very I'm, analytical. I'm You're quite very, analytical. Yeah. I'm quite pedantic um, at times. Who tells you that? You know, I'm, quite, I'm quite sarcastic. <laughs> um, and I do notice things when they're not right. And there are a few things which made me go, oh, why'd you do that? No, yeah, or yeah. Why, why did that? And I'm not going to say what those things are because I think the majority of people will probably overlook those. Yeah. And, um, you know, they may not spot them. I think a good number of people will. Yeah, yeah. But. Um, and we've hinted to one of them um, <laughs> subtly, um, and and it, it it just left me feeling a little bit underwhelmed. Yeah. And I'm really sorry to say that because I was so excited yeah, about yeah. this because it was such a new yeah concept um, and quite an exciting one. Um, 
And I think and a, I think, and I think, and I think a lot point. of people yeah. at the moment are really excited to try and get their material, whether it be new or, yeah. or just material that they perform daily, yeah. and get it onto YouTube and yeah. get themselves a promo video. And I think um, they also might feel a little bit mm. underwhelmed by yeah. this. Um, I mean, a lot goes into the... Peter Turner is very good at speech, very good at talking, very good at mm. creating oh, yeah, yeah, an emotion yeah, yeah. within somebody and mm. creating a story around things. And that yeah. is one of the main things I've learned from this, is, is mm. how to, he teaches you how to take something very small and turn it into something very big. Yeah, yeah. Uh, whether he goes into a lot of detail on how to do that, yeah. he goes into some detail. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's fair, mm. because he does... Yeah. I understand that you can't give yeah. too much away. No. However, for what is probably one of the higher end DVDs you mm. can purchase, you would expect a yeah. higher end delivery. You know, it reminds me of that old saying: "Is for an exceptional claim, you need exceptional yep. proof." Um, and and that mm. this kind of it, it struggles a bit with that. Yeah, yeah. But saying that, I'll give full credit to to World Magic Shop on yeah. their ability to produce an astounding DVD. The yep. quality of this is the production is fantastic. Well, the you, film work is yeah. brilliant. The, the editing of it, you the see direction, the credits at the end. The, the huge, yeah, yeah. You, you, probably the only Magic DVD to have full list of credits. I know, it was amazing. Was, I, was, you know, really impressed. I, was like, I was expecting production babies to and be on us. there. You we know? should do credits for the end of yeah, our yeah, review yeah, show. Yeah, maybe, maybe. Um, you know, You'll be in the camera. Obviously, obviously yeah. like, the DVD is really well produced. Yeah. It looks flash. Um, it has got some quality material on this, yep. but it is slightly diluted. You have to dig it out. That's the main. And you do have to dig it out. He, yep. he does say, actually, he, he clarifies what he determines as a professional to turn on this, okay. which I thought was really interesting. So he said most people see a professional, a uh, professional performer, entertainer, whatever, yeah. as someone that makes money from their job, yep. that makes money from what they're doing, their profession, uh, which I suppose technically is the actual um, description. Yeah, yeah. Whereas he says, I see a professional as um, someone that is able to uh, deduce and use that material yeah. um, and better what they've learned and expand upon it I and develop. That exact part, um, yeah. you know, whereas an amateur would just take what's given <clears throat> to them and regurgitate it. Yeah. And I think that's quite a nice way of looking yeah. at it. And in which case, I think um, the professional, in Peter's yeah. definition, would get a lot out of this. Mm. I do think some professionals, as yeah. in working professionals, might not get so much out of this because it all comes down to the, the common sense gene. Uh, and you know, it, it depends. Um, uh, it's very difficult to say. Yeah. Using the term what professional, each person will get out. Everyone's going to yeah, get yeah. something different out of this uh, yeah, video. Completely. Let's be honest. Yeah, yeah. Everyone's going to get something different out of it. Mm. Um, I mean, working-wise, is this? Would you consider this to be a worker? Well, it's a completely different you genre really of, even... of, of of magic of DVD release. I'd say it's certainly going to help you to become a worker in or help develop certain tricks to become yeah. a worker especially within the TV environment yeah, yeah. YouTube I mean, or web show I mean, if, if, you're, if you're looking seriously looking yeah. to put together a web series or, uh, or create a YouTube channel yeah. or maybe as Pete says create a pilot show that you yeah. want to send out to producers and execs yeah. then this DVD will go some way to help you yes I'm not going to say by buying this it will set you up it to won't. do that no no there is you far. everything, and there's lots of bits which yeah. seem to be skipped, which you know yeah. potentially should have been included. But yeah, yeah. Uh, I but mean, the, there is more to learn than what is on this DVD. Yeah. But granted, we know that you couldn't put a lot of that in. Yeah. I mean, the only other thing I'll mention is it does say, you know, uh, and and David is very good on the DVD. I will give him mm. full credit for that. He's very good as a host, as a presenter, yep. at reining mm. Pete in because he does have a tendency to go off on a tangent. Um, That's and my watch ringing. Brilliant. It's my watch. Right, no one cares. Um, <laughs> um, he does have a tendency to go off on a tangent, and, and David is exceptionally good at bringing him back and saying, no, Peter, what about this? Yeah. Uh, we're talking about this now. Uh, and one of those things that he mentions repetitively is, well, what about on TV, Peter? And, yeah. and, and Peter dodges a few bullets and says, well, you know, bats it off a bit and says, well, this is more for people that want to create a web, web series. Show, yeah, yeah. So I think we do need to stress that if you're more looking towards creating a web series, yeah. this is more tailored I mean, to that. There's a few things you'll, you'll get. If you were working oh. on TV producer and things, there's definitely a few th aspects on this that you could take away and integrate with people, yeah, there's depending a, on your relationship with them. The truth is, there's a lot more to TV work than what could be put into a magic DVD there, and yeah, sold to exactly. the, the, the professionals. Um, plus, I can understand why it's not all. And plus, we can bit. understand why it's yeah, not yeah. in there. But £150 pounds is the ticket price. Yes. Um, now, the thing is, a lot of the time now, that a lot of tricks are not expensive enough. You know, mm. for, for good quality information, you expect to pay good prices. So, this, at the end of the day, it is at very much the higher end, though. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. And I, I mean, have got to ask myself, would I spend yeah. £150 pound on this? 
again, as we mentioned before, if I was doing TV work, I wanted to create a web show series, mm. I think I would definitely invest in this just to yeah. take as much information if as I can. But this wouldn't yeah. be the only thing I'd get. Yeah, exactly. That's yeah. it. That's the, that's the point I, exactly I was going to make. If you are looking to create that web series, create that yeah, portfolio yeah. piece to send this to executives as a pilot, this is one of hundreds of resources I can think of. Exactly. Um, and the, the majority of them come from actual film work rather than a back, background, yep. rather than um, yeah. rather than magic, okay. because obviously nothing like this exists magic-wise. Yeah. Okay. So, um, so we've spent a long time on this now, but... We wanted to, we wanted to keep this comprehensive, so we knew yeah. it was going to be over ten minutes it's, for this review. It's, it's going to, yeah. Um, let's just now go on to DVD two without going into mm -hmm. too much detail. Mm -hmm. He mentions hypnosis. Okay, yeah. Now I am of course a professional hypnotist, hypnotherapist for six years, and stage hypnotist. So you could book him at <laughs> <Jeez, laughs> exactly, sales Yay! pitch coming on here. So yeah. basically, all I'm trying to say is I understand the language, I understand what's being done, I understand how usable this is in everyday situation. Mm -hmm. Now, we saw the the roulette bit at the beginning of the DVD. Yeah, yeah. Which was very impressive. Yeah, yeah. And it was probably, like you said, a it legend was, creator. It, 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 was probably yeah. the, it was probably the strongest element yeah. of, of, the, of, the uh, of the DVD, of the trailer yeah. of, of, you know. And, and when I saw that, I was like, oh, this is interesting. Yeah, yeah. I wonder what, what they're going to do to explain this. And they give you, re they say they can't, well, we can't go into too much detail, but there's, they can only show so much due to legal left, rights. Let's just things. say you're left with a bit of a cliffhanger. Yeah, yeah. You have to um, dig and find information. Um, yeah. And again, I think that's the motto of this. To be I honest, I think it is. To be fair, Th yeah. this is this is essentially the equivalent of um, kind of going um, hunting for hidden gems. Um, yeah. You know, yeah. It, you know, you, you are gonna get a little bit lost on the way, I think, watching this DVD, yep. and you're going to get a little bit confused. I, I, yep. I, I challenge anyone to watch this DVD and go, mm-hmm, yep, yep, I got it, yep, the yep. first time. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like the first time you read Pure Effect, and you went, what what, what exactly did yeah, I just yeah. read? Uh, and you have to read it again. Yep. Um, I certainly had to. Yeah, you can't um, just be having it on while you're eating your tea. You have to really focus you know, on it. And, but... and I'm, not, I'm not saying this DVD is yeah. comparable to Pure Effect, but what I'm, what I'm saying is, yeah, yeah. Um, it's that kind of thing where you... You're gonna to have to watch this twice. So I had to rewind bits and go, hang on, what did he just say again? Like, yeah. what what did he mean by that? And okay, you know. So, um, I, I, all in all, yeah, yeah. Effectively, from the hypnosis point of view, he That's goes it. over language and and points. Mm -hmm. um, he he shows you certain aspects of what you can do with hypnosis. However, he doesn't thoroughly teach you how to use it. He it's kind of like it's jump. It's br he teach you. He says himself he's not a professional hypnotist. Yeah, yeah. He's got the abilities to mm -hmm. find someone easily and work out who uh, in a way that not many people can, which I can probably believe with Peter Turner. Um, however, yeah, that, is it enough to learn if you have never done hypnosis before and you are a professional performer? It was, that's the question. To be honest, it was a little, bug, a little bit of a bugbear of mine when I watched the DVD yeah. when David asks, how did you know that girl was going to be good at hypnosis? Yeah. And, and Peter's response, I don't think justified the £150 price tag of the mm. DVD. Okay. Or even part of that price right. tag. It was a little bit jarring for someone that would have spent that amount of money, yeah, I yeah. think, on that DVD. Um, I just know. I, I'm not going to say what, what that is yeah. because yeah. I don't really want to reveal anything in the DVD mm. or, or tell you yeah. too much, but it, 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 would have, it would have upset me a little bit having spent a bit yeah. of money on this okay. to have that response come from the professional who's supposed to be giving yeah. you advice that I yeah. paid for. Yeah, I mean, could you, if you've never done hypnosis before, learn the skills required from what he's done from this? Do you think? No, no. no I, I honestly, no, I don't think you could. Yeah. I think you'd have to do more reading. You'd I have think to go with back hypnosis, to the basics. you have to. He says that well, certain books are read and yeah. and not just this, but I mean, he calls Anthony Jack. There's an he, attitude yeah. you have to go into to learn hypnosis. It's not just something mm. you can just do. It's something you build on as a personality within you. Um, yeah, and, and I can totally get the way he says. Like, I can tell who's suggestible and who's not because. It is something when you've done it for a long time or many mm. two or three, four years, you begin to easily find those spot people traits and spot or whatever. them. Um, but can it, you just do that straight away? No, it's something you'd have to put time into. Simple as that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we we should point out that obviously, following on from the, the yeah. very high quality production that this is, yeah, yeah, it does go on to what is essentially a screenshot, Google Plus, of a, of a Google Hangout, hangout. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Google Hangout with ha Anthony Jacklin yeah. and Peter Turner talking about basically yeah. the last section yeah. of uh, the section that Pete filmed yeah. with, with David yeah, uh, yeah. and this young girl called um, Bryony, I think, her Bryony. Name was, from from memory, uh, and. 
it, the quality of the DVD plummets. It does go down. Only bit. because the production quality was so high of the yeah. first bit to then go on to this Google Hangout chat just yeah. seemed a little bit sorrowful. Okay. Um, yeah, uh, it I, did, what it I did, did notice, I'm going to have to show you this. Fancy <laughs> Jeffrey just kind of like just uh, right, right. froze a few times. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Have you got it? <laughs> I, I have to show you this. Basically, this is a screenshot I took of uh, Anthony Jacqueline on the DVD. You can see this. Now, the astute people out there will notice a strange resemblance to a certain Heisenberg, uh, which hopefully you can see that. This made me laugh so much when I was watching it. For some reason, Anthony Jacqueline seems to have taken on the personality of a, um, a specialist meth dealer. But anyway, um, <laughs> just saying, um, it was quite funny um but anyhow this, com that, this conversation goes on for another maybe maybe an hour, hour, an hour, hour and a bit hour and 20 bit. minutes at yeah. least and, and it, again it is quite difficult to follow because you've got two people that, yeah. are, that are knowledgeable or semi knowledgeable in the field and you never Jack, incredibly knowledgeable yeah uh, and, and it, it, it's a lot of information to take on yeah. board as yeah. someone that might not have ever yeah. covered it before or wanting to so get what into I'd say it. is if you've if you like the hypnosis and that aspect of it there are various uh, things that we places we would recommend that you mm. can learn hypnosis from um, so certainly get in touch with myself and mm. I will quite happily provide as much advice yeah. as I can I mean what, what, I, what I found about this DVD is it really did feel like I was the third person yeah, yeah. in the room which I thought was quite nice yeah you know there's, it's Peter and David having a conversation yeah. and I felt like I was kind of watching yeah. that conversation evolve which was really yeah. nice uh, as I say there are a number of inconsistencies yeah. but I, I think I could overlook those of course, yeah. for the for the yeah. the golden nuggets that are in this. I think I could as well. Yeah. So I mean, but so, taking into account kind of the price tag yeah, yeah. and that information being a little diluted and few of the things that yeah. might not be quite yeah. right. And what what would you give it as a score? Because we've got to be honest to people out we here. We have now, to be honest. Buying this, I know. And I want to be as straight up and honest as I can. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to give this a six. Yeah. And I'm going to tell you why I gave it a six. Yeah. I give it a six because I think this DVD could have been half the length easily, if not less, yeah. if it had just been refined a bit. If, yeah. it had, if, if, if you just reined in a bit of that information. Um, I, I just think there's a lot of conversation that, that didn't need to be in there. Yeah. And there seemed I, a little bit... I would agree. I was between six, six, six and a half-ish. Okay. was my sort of ballpark. Yeah. So I but, think that's a fair... Yeah, a fair thing because it is a good DVD. It's a great DVD if you find yeah. those golden nuggets and those yeah, parts. Yeah, so. yeah. It, but again, you have to put the work yeah. in. Don't think you're buying this and being taught the secrets. You're not. No. You're buying this to have the opportunity to dig out the secrets. Yeah. But let's just get it straight. If you just seen it, you yeah. would have bought this just to get those one bits. Being a working pro, if I was putting together a video series, yeah, and I was serious about putting together that video series, yeah. yes, I'd buy it. Mainly because it's yeah. the only thing out there for yeah. magicians that has this information in yeah, it. Yeah. So it's 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 on its own in the yeah, marketplace. Yeah. You know there is no competition for this okay. really. Right. So exactly. so so yeah, you would. Yeah, you 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 would buy it. And I'm pretty confident I would as well. Yeah. Just to check it out. So there we are. So there we go. That's our review. It's quite a lengthy one, mm -hmm. but uh, we felt that we had to do yeah, that. Yeah. Ho hopefully you got out of this review something which is slightly <laughs> ironic because we've rambled as well. Yes, we uh, have. But it's very difficult to to sum this up. Um, so in any other way really yeah so exactly, pete so. i'd say well done pete it is a nice dvd well yep. done for having the balls to put together a new type of magic dvd yep. price tag i think is maybe a little bit high but i could see why you did that to yep. discourage people that you don't really want to give yep. these tips to i get that um and well done david for for actually producing such a a really yep. well um polished uh, finished without article question, uh, question, you're not going to so. get a much better quality nope. magic dvd than this so there we go that is the stem system you can get that from the links down below here awesome. in our youtube channel and uh, okay this is going to be a so long one this because it's going to got so many long. things however oh, no, okay be let's before we go to this next product yeah. uh, blackout let's just do a very quick two minute review of what you saw last night a Darren Brown show. Oh yes, cool, right. Boom. So I thought I'd do this. What's the name of the show? It's called Miracle. Miracle! Okay. Miracle, okay. Right. So basically, um, I know Darren doesn't like people talking much about um, so what's in his yeah, shows exactly, and stuff, so yeah. I'm not going to tell you what's in it. However, I did go to see it last night, and I know there's been a lot of chatter on Facebook yeah. and things like that, people really interested about what's happening. Yep. Um, all I'll tell you about the show is I really enjoyed it. I thought it was good. I thought it was a really polished production, yeah. as you would expect from Darren. Um, it was much uh, smoother. It was much cleaner. Yeah. Uh, there was some... As a magician, there were some absolutely, yeah. oh my God, that's brilliant moments yeah. uh, where I kind of snapped what was going on yeah. and I went, oh, you cheeky, <laughs> you know, um, you know, yeah. you bleep that yeah. out. Um, and I just thought that is brilliant, yeah. really clever. Um, 
Please don't go though expecting it to be better than Enigma because we all know that was the best thing he's ever I done, yeah, and he'll, yeah. he's never going to beat it. Yeah, um, it's still my favorite. So, one, so, so yeah, Enigma was the one everyone was talking about. It's the one that really was amazing. Yeah. So it's not as good as Enigma. Is it as dark as the last one? The last one was quite no, no, darkish. No, no. This like, one. Okay, so the problem I had with Infamous and and um, Svengali was that they they seemed a bit rushed and a bit. Uh, a bit broken. They're still good, though. Don't they? Oh, yeah, they were yeah, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, but they just seemed a bit broken and not quite as well finessed. Whereas this show yeah. was. It was. It was really well put together. My other half that came with me, she really enjoyed it. And yeah. She's not really into that sort of stuff. Um, and she watched it and she said, "You know what? That that was great." She said that that was worth the forty pound ticket. Right. So if you are in two minds, whether to I, see I'm gonna it, book it. When when's yeah. in Manchester? Uh, you know, what? I don't have a clue. I went to Liverpool Empire last uh, night. Uh, it was really good fun. It was really good fun, yeah. um, and it was really nice to to, to watch him back. Yeah, yeah. Uh, somewhere where I remember him being yeah, yeah. when he was in Enigma. Yeah. So it was really good, really energetic, and a really cool. I can't wait to see it. Yeah, yeah. So, so there's yeah. our review. If you're in two minds, head, yep. to, head to head to the website Ticketmaster. Yep. I think you worked out about four. We'll put the link to Ticketmaster down below yeah, as well, yeah. so you've got yeah. all the links. Of and where to go. obviously, Darren is in no way affiliated with this show um, or anything like that. This is just me telling you if you are interested. Yeah, you, you know, you're in the UK. It. Just go and see it. It's really good fun. Yeah, fabulous. Yeah. Okay, now let's move on to the third product mm -hmm. of the week. Of course, we yeah. have Blackout by Nefesh. Mm. Blackout. Yeah. This is the surprise contender. It is. This retails yeah. at twelve pounds ninety nine. I thought you wanted to swap places no. then. No, oh, just moving you over. Okay, twelve pound ninety nine. Now <laughs> we couldn't believe the price, could yeah, we? When yeah, we saw yeah. that, we thought it's going to be twenty five, thirty quid. Yeah. Um, and that it does justify something because the video quality is naff. <laughs> <laughs> it's nefesh. Uh, it's, it's, it's like a webcam on a boat or a webcam on this with all the wind. It's just right, the yeah. most horribly shot DVD ever. Oh, however, oh, 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 right. 12 right, right, Hang on, hang on. Before you even jump into that, okay, I let's tell these to. people what, what exactly. Let's jump to what. This is the trailer. Should... We'll jump to it now. We're going to learn together the blackout technique. And I have here as my guest, too, Romanos. Which is right. going to help us to go through every single little detail that you need to know in order to use this weapon whenever you're performing. Let me tell you that the blackout is not an effect, it's a technique. It's a technique that you can use to create your own effect. And although I'm sure that you're going to have a lot of fun thinking of ideas on how to use this new technique, I'm going to provide you with a few ideas that I have come up with so you can start performing this is for you to think of a playing card. Any playing card you want. Can you do that for me? Okay. Okay. Would, could, can you say it out loud? Yes. Um, seven diamonds. Seven of diamonds. Perfect. Now listen, it'll be very stupid for me to try to find your card and reveal it because I asked for it and I know it. I'm going to show you something impossible. Something amazing. Um, do you have a mobile phone with you? Yes, of course. Can you please uh, put it up? So listen carefully, listen carefully. Your card is going to be revealed by another person, not by me. You are allowed to select any person you want, any friend of yours, any relative of yours, any person in your contacts mm -hmm. that you can call with your own phone. Would that be amazing if we can do that? Okay. Would you like to change your mind for another card? No, we'll give it. Okay, perfect. Could you call any person you want and once you establish communication, just tell him that I'd like to speak with this person. Okay, I'll pick one. Okay. Hey, Marie, hello. Uh, I want you to speak with one of my, of my friends. Please, okay. Could you could you actually put it on speaker? Ah, okay. Would that be fine? Perfect. Hello? Hi, nice to meet you. What, sorry, what's your name? Marius. Uh, nice to meet you. My name is Nefesh. I'm here with your friend. I'm, I'm a mentalist, kind of a magician. Um, let me ask you a question. Do you have about two or three minutes so we can try to make a trick together? Okay. Alright, listen. Um, right now, your friend is thinking of a playing card, and normally I should try to reveal the card. But I'd like to make this more impossible, and I want you to reveal what card he's thinking of. Could you help me with this? Okay. Okay. 
Do you have an entire value right now in your mind? Would you be so kind, please, to say that out loud? What card do you think he's thinking of? What? Say that again. What did you say? Seven of diamonds. Seven of diamonds. Okay, that's exactly. That that's exactly the card that he was thinking of. How did you find it? How did you find it, the number? How did you find it? Please tell me, how did you find it? Do you have one name in your mind? Okay, can you please say it out loud now? Whoa. Say that again, say that again, say that again. Joanna. Are you serious? Joanna. Joanna. Okay. Ask Bastuni. Ask Bastuni. Yes, uh, let me ask you a question. How did you know the name? Well, that was, that was not possible to find that name. It was unbelievable. And if there is if no there trailer, wasn't a trailer then, <laughs> then, um, then we'll just carry on, we'll just carry on as we okay. are doing right so now. So essentially the basic effect is that it's almost like a, um, uh, what, what do they call it, uh, like a magician's assistant yeah, over yeah. the telephone, oh my god what was it called, like the wizard telephone call, yeah, I can't yeah. remember exactly Doc what Hilford does something similar, okay, so, a few people do so this. So the idea is you have someone think of a playing card yeah. in the room that you're in, they say it out loud, everyone knows what it is, you yeah. ring up one of their friends off their phone, not your own, yeah. uh, you're not using a clever app here, yeah. you ring someone off their phone, and they're on, and, speakerphone, and they're on speakerphone, and, and while you're talking to them, they reveal the playing card yep. that is being thought of by people in the room yep. um, and it is it's quite devious you know, isn't it you know what it's I, quite devious you know what I thought this is going to be yeah, yeah. this is going to be yeah. we, I went on the cafe forums last night and some people were either slating it or loving it yeah, yeah. but none really have given a proper review on this product so that's why we, we thought we'd integrate yeah. it into our show yeah. and, and, do, and do you know what I when the method came up yeah. I thought that is actually quite clever it, is it really reminded clever. me of something uh, very similar that I saw, um, what's he called? Patrick, Patrick Red, uh, Patrick Red, Red, Redford. Patrick Redford, is that your name? Something like that. Messy yeah. name it is. Um, he did something quite similar a few years ago, which yeah. I remember reviewing uh, with Ollie Meal in years yeah, and years yeah. ago. However, um, this is kind of similar, but yeah. not, and it's I think much better, and it is very clever. The spectator on the phone reveals that pl thought of yeah. playing card or word or whatever, um, and it's really good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you get a nice DVD, and it works in a different way than we expected, you know, yeah. and a lot cleaner way you know, than you, we expected. You, you get a DVD, but as you've yeah. already mentioned so passionately, it's pretty poor. Uh, and when However, I, I didn't mean to be that passionate about it. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nefesh. However, as I we said. It comes with a PDF, and I showed it to you. Yeah, yeah. And the way we'd just say is, forget the DVD. <laughs> you just read the PDF. Yeah. The, the, the problem with the DVD is half of it's in Greek, um, and if you're not fluent well, in Greek, well, it's, it's only that tiny little portion. You yeah, a little right. bit of. You I, might a Greek have, I might have exaggerated slightly there. Yeah, just but. a little bit, but um, and it's his language barrier and everything else. But the PDF has everything readed out and yeah, yeah, marked nice. out, so yeah, it tells you exactly what to do, what points. It's a simple PDF, but it does the job. Yeah. Um, and, and you know, it's sometimes the simplest things are the best, yeah. and, and that does work quite well. The DVD uh, is very much handy cam, mm. with a terrible microphone, you can hardly hear it looks them like a points. webcam, to be honest. It's, it's, <laughs> it's windy, uh, yeah, it yeah. looks like they're on a cruise yeah, yeah. ship. Um, you know, I mean, clearly, I'd like they, to be on a cruise ship, clearly, clearly they've got better weather than us yeah, in yeah. Manchester, so you can knock it, but it is a pretty amateur. Why don't we shoot a review show on a cruise ship? We should, uh, if, yeah, well, uh, yeah, expenses paid, thanks very much. Um, you know, it, it is pretty amateur yeah, DVD. It is. However, the effect is anything but. Yeah. And I actually think it's quite good. It is quite I, good. I was surprised. Yeah. And I think this goes some way to proving that magic still can be sold as being the kind of under delivery, uh, the kind of. Um, understated. Under deliver, over promise, is that you said earlier? No, it's the complete opposite. Oh, of oh that. sorry. <laughs> Over deliver, under promise. No, no under promise, and it's <laughs> over delivered. Okay? Well, okay. Whereas, whereas some yeah. of the things on the market yeah. might over promise and slightly under deliver. Yeah. Whereas this, this, this doesn't. This, this, this I was question. not expecting anything out yeah. of this, and for twelve quid, yeah, 
Like, and all we can say is it's much better than you can imagine. Yeah. The methods behind it and the way it works it's, it's is very, much better it's, it's than you clever. can imagine. It's so. very clever. And it, and it works. And, and it'll work with Android. It'll work with pretty much any phone, except yeah. for, as he says, a BlackBerry. Black don't bother on a BlackBerry. It, it, it's just awkward. Yeah. It's but it's great awkward. that you don't have to have rely on a certain app that can only work on one type of phone, iPhone and, S. And, and it's a miracle. It uh, a miracle. You know, it looks really cool. It's impromptu. It's, yeah. There's no setup. There's no yeah. anything like that. Yeah. Um, so that is our kind of like our secret seller of the week, really. This is, I would say, I, I, would I use this in a gig though I mean I'd pick and choose my moments to use it yeah. because this is certainly I think a lounge piece yeah. after you've performed someone might come up to you with a group of friends and yeah. say can you show us one last thing yeah. that old chestnut yeah. and you could whip this out yeah. well you're not whip to whip out. out actually so to speak <laughs> whip it out I'll yeah. have a good party with them uh, <laughs> but anyway, yeah. on that side no. <laughs> on the note of whip it out <laughs> the, uh, you, you, there's nothing there's no gimmick like, yeah. that's what I mean to say there, there's nothing you're you quite to easy ready. to learn it's more about the presentation yeah, yeah. and and uh, it's yeah. certainly something that I would be interested in putting into my yeah yeah my I, I, I I would definitely learn it as one of those yeah. one-off moments. Uh, it's not something that would go into my working set, yeah. but it however, is something that might be very memorable to the people you're performing. I, I for can imagine. For a long, long I time. can imagine if you're doing this on stage, mm. and as I've consulted my uh, expert mentalism friend uh, yeah. Aaron Calvert. Um, Darren does something very similar to this effect yeah, in yeah. Um, Evening of Wonders. Okay, and. But he reveals a different type of information. Right. He reveals a uh, serial on a banknote, I okay. believe. Yeah, yeah. Um, and, and I think it's a very similar method to yeah. that. So if you if you you know if you want in a better trailer experience yeah. uh, for Nefesh's, yeah, uh for blackout, then then watch that. And that's kind of what you're yeah, getting yeah. with this. And for twelve quid, but it is different though. It is. It, different. It, oh, it's that's a different the main effect. Thing. Totally it's different, different effect. Yeah. It's a different. Well, kind of. Yeah. <laughs> kind. Of. Um, <laughs> but it's the same idea of ringing up yeah, yeah. someone that wasn't expecting a phone call, yeah. and they deliver a piece of information yeah. which is known by everyone. And in the it's room. great because I normally stay away from mobile magic, but this is brilliant. Yeah, yeah. Uh, because it's a phone call. A phone yeah. call is still simple. Yeah. Um, and it is, and it's one of their friends, and it's great. Uh, so yeah. I think that is a secret kind of ninja, secret ninja, ninja seller of the week. Yeah, we definitely. Break that. Definitely. So is this going to go on the workers' wall though? So this is the thing because. We got a work as well. We've not it, mentioned it. It, it would, but one. it would go like you know. It wouldn't be like up here with like the you know the invisible Workers deck. Dream and you know like okay. <laughs> yeah, it, we all it's, work. Yeah, we all work. It's a hit in the middle. You or know, we, the we, all, we all use the invisible deck. Highly don't, recommend don't trick it. yourself. We're just uh, being highly recommended. Let's oh, put it highly I'd, recommended. I'd highly recommend the twelve quid. I, I, I wouldn't even think about twelve ninety nine. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> and that's that's Nefesh's blackout. Well done, Nefesh, because it's actually bloody, fantastic. Bloody bloody brilliant, brilliant. Yeah. brilliant. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're pretty much at the end of the review. Yeah. Show, you, yeah? you, you want to do your competition though? I'm about to do it. Yeah, I've got it here. The Zap Go wallet. for it. Okay. The competition for this week, because we missed it out last week, is we are going to be giving away a bottle of water. Oh no! That's... <laughs> no, we're going to give away a Zap wallet because last week we were talking about wallets, uh, mentalism. We want to keep along that theme, and we've had a load of sales for Zap wallets since the last since last week. Now you're pushing me off the screen. No, I'm not. And uh, this was fabulous one. Now this is the brown version. It's brown and black, um, but they're on our website. The link is below. A winner's going to get this this week, or for next week, we'll reveal. Mm -hmm. All you need to do is leave a nice comment, subscribe to our channel, Facebook, you know, the usual, like us, do all those things, but just leave a nice comment and uh, give us any any ways we can improve. Okay, uh, what, am I going on <laughs> a bit <laughs> too much now? Yeah, basically, like the video and leave us some feedback. That'd That's be the amazing. One. That's the one. And we'll randomly select someone next week and uh, we'll post it out to you. So awesome. uh, there we go. That is Review Show 29. Happy days. Happy days. Um, and I hope you enjoyed the review show as much as we did, because mm -hmm. it, it was good fun. It's good fun to have you yeah. back, mate. Oh, thank you very much. Fantastic. Yeah. I'm James Anthony. This is... Sam Fitton. Uh, SamFitton.com. You will get his website down there as well. <laughs> is that all right? Do you want to mention it? It's okay. Oh, oh, yeah, but I don't know James why. JamesAnthony.co.uk. SamFitton.com. Why a magician's going to book a magician? Who knows? Who we knows? might be non-magicians watching this. Anyway. <laughs> Bye for now. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. Subscribe. Really cool. It's yeah. a really nice DVD, but it's 150 pounds. You'd expect them to put the quality in here. You wouldn't. Uh, and, and it's very neat. And the green screen is <laughs> gone. Ah! Oh, what happened then? It's okay. We don't need to cut it. We we'll just keep it going. So while he fixes the stage, um, <laughs> the stem system. Uh, we're gonna have to start again, mate. We don't have to start again. We really do. Why? No, we don't. It's fine. Put a pack of cards there. That's not gonna hold it. A pack of cards. <laughs> a pack of cards will stop it moving. There we go. A tiny bit to the left.